Young Miami's car is shot at. Chance the Rapper worries fans with scary tweets. Plus, will Drake and Chris Brown star in a movie together? Hey guys, it's Allie for Hollywood Life with your hip hop roundup, starting with Lollapalooza and Rich the Kid. A clip of gate crashers went viral over the weekend, and at the end of the clip, we see a guy with a prosthetic leg get caught by security. Rich the Kid saw the footage and decided to treat the dude with a free pass to the music festival, which is pretty nice of him, but gate crashers should not be rewarded. Sorry for being a drag, but. Yeah. Moving on to Joe Budden, because a viral list of the greatest rappers of all time placed him at number three, and it confused everyone. Plenty of people reacted to the list on Twitter and beyond, including Joe, who said, I ain't make that list, but I ain't arguing against it. And can you blame him? But okay, let's talk about Chance the Rapper, because he had plenty of fans worried yesterday after tweeting about self-harm. Chance started the long thread saying, I'm getting this crazy feeling that people want me to kill myself, and followed up by saying that not my vibe at all, but I feel the push. Chance talks about being made to feel like he should be ashamed of things he was once prideful about and ends it all by tapping into the viral joke that has surrounded his new album, that he really loves his wife. And despite fans rallying to support Chance after he opened up, many just saw his tweet as a man making up excuses for an album that flopped. But all right, late last night, Young Miami was reportedly shot at by a car with no lights. Police responded immediately and even though the rapper's G-Wagon was towed away from the scene, no one was hurt. Here's what Miami told the police. They just started shooting, but you know, like, they had their lights off, so I never saw them. Like, whoever was, they, they had their lights off. I don't know where they came That's from. That's where they were sitting. They no, it came from behind me. The shots started from behind me. They didn't start, they started from behind me because when I got to the I said, oh shit, somebody was shooting. The first shot hit the, the, the fucking spell time thing. And then I don't know how the shots came from the side because it's in my window. I think they were going to try but okay, director Chris Robinson recently went on Amp Morning Show to talk about what it was like to work with Chris Brown and Drake on the music video for No Guidance. At one point, Robinson's asked if he has any plans to work with the two artists on a film or TV project, and he responds with a horrible idea that involves them being the new Will Smith and Martin Lawrence in a Bad Boys reboot. No, no, no. Drake and Chris Brown are pretty damn good at what they do, but putting them on a Will and Martin level? Nah. This ain't it, Chief. By the way, we posted this in the community tab and a bunch of you came through with some really funny comments. Here are some of our favorites. But all right, guys, hit the sub, like, and bell button. Comment if you would watch a Drake and Chris Brown movie and follow me on social media at Ali Stagnita. Bye, guys. Also, let's put up...